Hello children. Today we are going to learn properties of addition. Order in addition. What does that mean? That means when we add numbers with their orders changed, their sum remains the same. Now let's see an example. Here we have the number 1 and the number 3 kept in order. As you know, 1 in between there is a 2 and then comes 3. So this is kept in this order like 1 and 3. Now we are going to add this 1 plus or add to the 1. Now let's count and see what is the answer or the result or the sum. That means 1 plus 3. 1 plus 3 equal to 4. We learned in the previous class that when we add 1 to a number, we get the next number. So now this is easy for you to understand. And you can find out the answer by yourself. 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. You know that. So 1 plus 3. In this example, the same. The answer is 4. Okay. Now, I am just going to change the order. I am putting this 3 here. I am putting the 1 here. Now let's see what's the answer or the result or the sum. 3 plus 1. Is there any change? No, there is no change. Now let's see one more example. Look into this pond. We can see a mama duck and her three baby ducks. What do we call a baby duck? Yes, we call them duckling. So, we are going to count and see how many baby ducks are there in this pond. One, two, three. There are three ducklings. This little duck or duckling is very naughty. He used to jump here and there and he jumped and sat on mama's shoulder. Now how many ducks, baby ducks or ducklings are there in this pond? Let's count and see. Two. One, two. And one on mama's shoulder. Now let's see total or the sum or the result of these ducks. One plus two, three ducks. The mama duck said, come on children, let's go home. All of you, come and sit on my shoulder. But again, this little naughty duck, this baby duck, he jumped back to the pond. And now let's see how many ducklings are there for the mama. Two plus one. Again, the answer is 3. The sum is 3. 1 plus 2 is 3. 2 plus 1 is 3. 1 plus 2 is 3. Okay, children. See you in next class. Bye-bye.